There is more to a restaurant than simply good food and reasonable prices. Granted, these are very important, and along with marketing, good management, a great interior decor, highly trained and loyal staff, you will find yourself with a recipe for success. One of the key elements that can separate your establishment from the competition is service. Service not only fulfills the needed purpose of bringing food to the customers, but it can also enhance the atmosphere and experience. Having the right staff for the job is obviously important, but there's more than one type of service that can be used. The trick is to find the right style to suit your needs. 那么盘式服务呢？我们也叫美式服务。它的特点呢，就是所有的食物呢，在那个厨房呢，全部做好。由服务员呢，到厨房呢，用盘子把食物。啊，从厨房运送到客人面前的这样的一种服务方式。Heat lamps are used in kitchens to keep food warm while the waiters are preparing to take the food away. If left on the heat lamps too long, the food becomes dry and in time start to cool down. Another form of service is family service or English service. In this method, the food is delivered to the table in different bowls and platters. The guests can select from these dishes and decide exactly how much they want and what they would like. Buffets, smorgasbords and salad bars are a kind of family service. Often, in these cases, hot dishes may be placed in a bain-marie food warmer. Removing entire dishes from these can be difficult and staff must take care not to damage any presentation or injure themselves. An alternative service method is that of the table-side service. 法式服务呢，通常呢，我们也把它称之为，呃，餐车服务或者叫做礼资服务。那么它在西餐服务当中呢，是属于一种比较高级的服务。呃，它的特点呢，就是通常有两位服务员呢，同时为客人进行服务。他们通常是推着餐车啊、呃，在客人的餐桌旁呢。啊，进行服务的菜的最后一道程序呢，是当着客人的面在餐车旁完成的，所以具有表演的性质在里头。A gyrodon is a rolling cart. It is unique in that it is supplied with heat to keep the meals hot. It's also used to finish off dishes or to prepare sauces that complement other dishes. The last style of service is perhaps the most famous of them all. It is, of course, silver service. Silver service, in many ways, is the highest standard of service styles. But it is not a style that would be suitable for every establishment or atmosphere. Different target markets dictate largely what style of service should be used. So service is sort of a high-level experience uh, for dining. Uh, it, it entails the kitchen and preparing the, the meals as normal, but uh, in certain portions, presenting them on platters or plates that are taken out to the guests, and then using a, a sort of fork and or a sort of fork and spoon, uh, the, the waiters present the food to the um, to the guests, and the guests select, and then they serve that food onto the plate. Finding the right style of service is very important. This will dictate how you will train your staff and what will be expected from them. Not only this, but the style of service used says a lot about your establishment. For example, if you want to produce fast, cost-effective meals, but then use a silver service style, this would not only be impractical, but potentially confusing for your customers as well. This brings us to the end of our final episode. Thanks for joining us as we've journeyed through sectors of the food service industry, different food and beverage operations, classes of menus, and the importance of service.